got me, my mule got lame. Lost my money in a poker game. When storm came, one summer's day. Carried the house to live in a way. Having so much trouble. released over 25 years ago in November 1968. And although this was only reached number 62 in the chart, it enjoyed enormous critical acclaim. The band, named after an 18th century English agriculturalist, came into the studios of the BBC on the 23rd of July 1968 to record their first session, before they'd even signed a record deal. From it comes this classic track, dedicated to the band's former bass player, Geoffrey Hammond Hammond. It's Jethro Tull with Song for Jeffrey.
to see where I'm going. No seas to see where I'm going to. I don't want to. Song for Jeffrey, Jethro Tull, recorded in session at the BBC in 1960. Today's classic track was recorded at the studios of the BBC in July 1968, before the band even had a recording deal. At that time, the group were a four-piece. Mick Abrahams on guitar, Clive Bunker behind the drums, Glenn Cornick on bass, and Ian Anderson, who was rapidly emerging as the group's leader and main songwriter on flute and vocals. The track you're about to hear features on the band's debut album, This Was. So, here they come, Jethro Tull with My Sunday Feeling.
My Sunday Feeling. Jethro Tull there from 19... <laughs> Today's classic track comes from Jethro Tull, who took their name from the 18th century English agriculturalist who invented the first seed drill. The group's leader, Ian Anderson, has retained his connections with farming by purchasing large areas of land on the west coast of Scotland and investing in the highly lucrative Strathaird salmon processing plant. He's also enhanced his environmental credentials with a string of songs inspired by the British landscape. Acres Wild, Songs from the Wood, One Brown Mouse, Farm on the Freeway, and Heavy Horses, to name but five. But back in the late 1960s, when today's classic track was recorded at the studios of the BBC, Ian Anderson had yet to attain his current status as Lord of the Manor. In fact, he was employed on a beggar's farm. <laughs> And your reputation's going 
down Going out in the night time You think you make no sound But you don't fool me Cause I know what you feel When you go out I won't ask you why And I won't worry when I see you lying down on beggar's farm Way down on beggar's farm Beggar's Farm, Jethro Tull, live at the BBC. 1968 saw the emergence of a band who took their name from an 18th century agricultural pioneer and built their reputation as leaders of the British folk rock movement. Since then, their style has changed, but their popularity has remained, a fact underlined when they won the first ever heavy metal Grammy. Today's classic track is not heavy metal. Recorded at the BBC in November 68, this is Love Story from Jethro Tull.
Love Story from 1968. That's our classic track from Jethro. T- uh, it's really nice to be able to tell you that a lot of fans here in Britain are really going for this kind of music. Now, this is Jethro Tull one more time. Ian Anderson there on flutes. You know this group could be the biggest attraction since the Stones. Now, this is a T-Bone Walker blues. I said they called it Stormy Monday. Mm-hmm. And I said that you're dead, just about had this I said you called it Stormy Monday. Remember that name, friends. Less than 12 months after they first got together in the seaside town of Blackpool in northwest England, Jethro Tull were making hit records. And today's classic track is a unique BBC recording of one of their earliest and best loved songs. It was first broadcast on BBC Radio 1 in June 1969, and it's important to remember that in those days these performances really were live recorded and mixed as they happened and they sound remarkably good too here they are then from 1969 jethro tull living in the past
Living in the Past from 1960. Today's classic track from Jethro Tull was recorded at the BBC in June 1969 and showcased material from their forthcoming second album, Stand Up, released eight weeks after this session took place. It reached number 20 in the charts and marked the debut of their new guitarist, Martin Barr, who's still in the band almost a quarter of a century later. All the songs on the album were written by lead vocalist Ian Anderson, with the exception of an instrumental, Bourre, originally composed by Bach. From the album comes this, the live BBC version of It's a New Day Yesterday.
It's a new day yesterday. Jethro Tull, live at the BBC in 1960. In the early days of their 25-year history, Jethro Tull established a formidable reputation as a live act. Frontman Ian Anderson was the visual focus, with his wild hair, manic expression, and a tendency to perch on one leg while playing the flute. Behind him, the constantly varying lineup has always been composed of superb musicians, as you're about to hear. Today's classic track is taken from the band's second album, Stand Up. So, from the studios of the BBC in June 1969, here's Jethro Tull and Fat Man. <laughs> Let's go down a mountain that I'm sure the fat man will win. 
Jethro Tull celebrated their 25th anniversary by releasing a superb box set of their career highlights. The selection must have proved difficult, with nearly 20 albums worth of material to choose from, to say nothing of the numerous live recordings they've made over the years. They may not have had a single in the American charts for almost two decades, but a steady stream of albums and tours helps maintain their huge popularity. Today's classic track dates from 1969 when the BBC paid the band the princely sum of $50 to record this exclusive live version of Nothing Is Easy. Okay. Just take your life 
nothing is easy. Jethro Tull recorded at the studios of the BBC in at this point, so it's one more from everybody. This is Jethro Tull coming in first of all with a song for Jeffrey.
now a new group. New to some of the pubs anyway. So, lead a team with the singular name of Jethro Tull, with a song by group member Ian Anderson called My Sunday Feeling. My Sunday Feeling's coming on over me.
and listen now to the sensational music of the great Jethro Tull, leaders of the progressive scene in Britain today. Uh, too much. And here comes Ian Anderson with one of his own songs. My first and last time with you. And we had some fun We're walking through the trees, yeah And I kissed you on